I am now in Huzhou, a lakeside city renowned for its thriving fishery sector. Well, the place I'm standing right now is a smart fish farm that uh, has adopted inter, uh, innovative techniques, uh, which was developed about two years ago. And here in this farm, farmers can actually monitor their fish through an app, uh, adjusting the oxygen level and also controlling the aerators. And these specialized tanks uh, can maximize production level. And in this farm alone, uh, there's, can, there's uh, 230 tons of fish produced annually. And that's about 10 times uh, the output of the regular traditional pond. And to give our viewers a better understanding of how many fish are here in one tank, I'm gonna feed them with a little treat. Whew. Wow, as you can see, there's, let me tell you, there's actually about 5,000 fish here in one tank, uh, all competing for the treat. Well, besides this, there's also an intelligent uh, water circulation system installed in the tank, which encourages fish to swim against a current, which will result in uh, firmer and higher quality fish for consumers. Well, besides these innovative techniques, Huzhou is also famous for its mulberry fish pound. And in this system, farmers would uh, plant the mulberry trees in the dikes, and the leaves of the uh, mulberry trees will then feed the silkworms, and then uh, re and the fish in the in the pound. And farmers would utilize the mud from the pound uh, for the mulberry trees, and resulting in a self-sustaining circle. And this method was actually recognized as a globally important agricultural heritage system by FAO of the United Nations in 2017. Well, uh, the vibrant fish farming techniques are all um, are driving the Huzhou's economy, uh, but also the tourism tourism sectors. So, um, so many various kinds of fish-themed festivals are held here in Huzhou annually, where visitors can learn more about Huzhou's rich cultures, as well as have the, have the chance to taste the delicacies prepared by Huzhou's unique cooking style. Well, that's about lunchtime, Donning. I think I'm gonna go try some Huzhou specialty fish and hope you can one day come here and give it a try as well.